hanging out here in Brewerton, made the trip up here on Tuesday. We're at Promotion Metal Fabrication, just north of Brewerton Speedway. Jeremy Corcoran just had himself a fun weekend as he promoted Motorsports Expo at the New York State Fairgrounds. Jeremy, first of all, how's everything going? Good, good. Uh, first, I want to thank you know the sponsors and stuff, Dot Foods, FX Caprera, Hoosier, uh, Power Seal, VP. You know, without them, like I always do the interview, you know, it couldn't happen. My family, my stepson, Michael, Tyler, Emily, mm -hmm. you know, they were all there helping out, doing tickets and punching tickets. And I was running around trying to make everybody happy and all that stuff. All in all, it was a good show. Mm -hmm. You know, attendance was about the same as last year. A couple of people, uh, vendors say, hey, it seemed like it was off. But Saturday was packed. It was packed. From 11 until 3.30, 4 o'clock. Then I kind of faded off. It was pouring rain. And unfortunately, you know, I got rid of my racetrack hoping that I wouldn't have to deal with weathermen anymore. But <laughs> unfortunately, we still had to deal with them, you know, with this winter storm and uh, we didn't get nothing. You know, I think they scare the crap out of people not to do anything Sunday. That's why Sunday was off. But I mean, it still is OK. Mm -hmm. But I, anybody that wanted to travel, they weren't coming because they thought it was going to snow and it never did. Yeah, we got a little bit Sunday uh, night, maybe a couple of inches. But it was gone by not even. Time. Yeah, here so. we didn't even I didn't have to plow. I plow a couple of contracts and stuff and we didn't have to plow. So, I mean, it's just unfortunately, you know, those people that, you know, didn't come, they missed out. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? And uh, there's some other car shows up in Canada and stuff like that. So everybody's trying to get these car shows. So every Every one we lose is something, you know, whether it's a fan or, mm -hmm. you know, a vendor or something like that, you know, and um, a couple of comments on Facebook I want to touch on, too, is like, you know, one guy, one guy put out there that, oh, it's not a, there wasn't very many vendors there. This has never been a vendor show. No, this has a been a car, car show. show. And a racetrack with, show. Yeah, racetrack, mm -hmm. you know, more for the vent, cars, right. racetracks, and then there was vendors added. You know what right. I mean? So it was never a vendor show. No, it's you know? different than what you do in the fall. That's oh, a vendor-driven show it's, there. It's 360 so. degrees, you know what I mean, different. So, but yeah. everything, all in all, was a good show, and I'm glad that people that come out and support it and the race cars that come out and support it. You know, I'm going to try to do something with the tracks next year. Um, it was, it, guys don't want to do this anymore. You know, what, what but the mean? sponsor, they don't want to bring their cars anymore. Oh, you know I, what I see. Mean? Everybody's, mm -hmm. you know, I will do this, but the sponsors need it. You know what I mean? They the do. sponsors need it. The tracks need it because all these schedule cards reaches people. And, you know, it's a fan, fan oriented. Without the fans, we don't have racetracks. It's Without true. racetracks, we don't have race cars. Yeah. So, uh, you know, I, I'm nervous myself um, that racing is going in the wrong direction. You I, know, agree. Uh, I agree. It's getting way too expensive. Mm -hmm. The purses aren't going up at the racetracks. Well, their costs the act are going up too. Well, absolutely. You, you I did. ran a racetrack, you know, so yeah. I know you can't just keep adding, adding, adding to the purses. Right. Everything's going up. You know, some mm -hmm. tracks can add to the purse around here because they're nowhere near the, the tracks that we race at and stuff. But uh, all in all, I, I just don't know where it's going to be in a few years from now. I agree. I agree. And we need these shows like this because I outside of the – the business aspect of it I, there's not many times when all of us get together and talk because when we're at a racetrack we're all busy correct and yeah and so, you can't talk at a racetrack you know no. you hear you say you're, hi and that's you're, yeah you're working it. on yeah. your car or you're mm -hmm. doing something or whatever but you or you're, you're a fan and you're missing the rate heat race and stuff so this was the time to do it and uh mm -hmm. like i said you know i want to try to work on something with the racetracks where we can get okay. a half price season pass or something to bring your car you know put something out november 1st the first 10 cars get a free pit pass or something whether i got a eat the cost and paying for them or okay. or uh, one thing we are going to do that uh my wife talked to uh, uh denise at utica Rome speedway next year sunday is going to be 10 bucks to get in you know we're going to drop it to 10 oh, bucks lower and, the price yeah, for sunday. yeah we're going to lower for somebody sunday to try to get some more you know any trade show you go to whether mm -hmm. it's this the farm show or a, a home show sunday yeah. is always a dead day it is it's in saturday even if you go day. friday saturday well it, maybe not the fridays usually the well the friday day, but, yeah. yeah fridays it's <laughs> now you know a lot of these shows are going to one day you know so know. you know and i am looking just to, it's kind of been talking i'm i'm looking to do another show at the fairgrounds maybe in february a harley show oh uh, i might okay. be doing so i'm working with some people with that and that's going to be a one day show in and out so there'll be nice. more on that to to okay. come hopefully so and you mentioned and i did want to touch on this because you thanked everybody and Lori, i'm thinking about yeah. you let's be honest <laughs> your wife uh, oh yeah absolutely uh, is, is wonderful we were joking that uh, um both my wife and your wife have to put up with us <laughs> yeah know? so it's not, not always easy yeah but, it's uh, a struggle putting up with me because i'm going in 100 different directions all the time well, so you're, i you're forget things i'm getting old and whatever so yeah you're like me 100 miles an hour yeah. sleeping there's almost yeah. nothing in between so. exactly so thank you to both of our absolutely. wonderful loving and understanding wives because right. who knows what we'd be doing Oh, if, yeah. uh, if they were there yeah, to keep us a exactly. little more even keel. Exactly. Always good to see you guys. Again, Absolutely. thanks to everybody who helped me out over the weekend. Thanks to all of you guys for talking with me. And uh, Jeremy, as always, uh, I look forward to the fall show uh, right before Thanksgiving, the weekend before Thanksgiving. So we'll be talking about that. And uh, again, thanks for all your help for making it easy Absolutely. for me to come thank and do you. that. All right. Thank you. Make sure to subscribe, turn on the likes, leave a comment if you'd like, turn on the notifications. And uh, so we're having a pretty good week here, guys. We want to make sure that we get to your favorite driver. So just leave us a message and we'll get to them real soon.